Your favorite neighborhood pizza place. Everyone goes to Pizza Joe's. This program made possible by a grant from Pizza Joe's. Five would like to thank Butts, Flores, and Gifts for their fine cooperation for this podcast. Remember, when you need that special gift, it's Butts. Keep watching NCTV45. Gary's Wardrobe, furnished by Main Street Clothiers and Custom Tailors, 210 East Washington Street, Newcastle. From the NCTV45 studios in downtown Newcastle, it's Focus NC with your host, Gary West. Thank you very much, and... This segment two of Focus NC today being brought to you by Main Street Clothiers and Custom Tailors in down, excuse me, downtown Newcastle, and also Butts Flowers and Gifts in downtown Newcastle. And also we want to thank Pizza Joe's with four locations in Newcastle. Everyone goes to Pizza Joe's. My guest today is Janet Filonico. She is the executive director of the Lawrence County Tourist Promotion Agency. And in case you missed the first segment, we talked about uh, businesses and business members and the website and all those um, almost 200 members that belong to the TPA. And you can go to visit lawrencecounty.com and check out all those businesses and find out how you can be a member, too, of the Lawrence County Tourist Promotion Agency. Janet, good to have you back with us. Thank you, Gary. I appreciate it. And uh, there truly is a lot to do in Lawrence County, and we're, we're making sure everybody knows about that. And everyone can always go to your, your website. Uh, it's a very comprehensive list of events that can be found right there on the website. Visit lawrencecounty.com. Tell us a little bit about that, Janet. Well, we have become the number one events listing on visitlawrencecounty.com, uh, but we have so much more than that. We try to tell the visitor and the resident things that they might not know. Uh, we have a blog section. Blog is very new to us. We have not used that for ever. And now we're having videos that are posted on our blogs, things that happen during Tourism Week, which we mentioned earlier in the other segment. And uh, there are things that you can find out about businesses, a spotlight on businesses. We're starting that. It's a new thing for us, and we're happy to be a part of it. Uh, you can also shop for merchandise. Now, we both know that this is the fireworks capital of America, so in doing that, we have merchandise that are t-shirts, hats, tote bags, mugs, books, different things, but most of the merchandise has fireworks capital of America, Newcastle, Pennsylvania. One year, we didn't put Newcastle, Pennsylvania on there, and it did not go over well, so we learned our lesson, and we keep it on there. Yeah, I, I was impressed uh, with your website, and you know we're focusing right now on things to do in Lawrence County and no matter where I go in the county there's something going on and, and we're trying to convey that to the public and let them know that a lot of people know there's a lot going on but you, you still have your, your people that might have been on another planet and say they, they always use that that phrase or that that question you know what's going on in Lawrence County well go to the website visit Lawrence County Dot com, and that's, that's the website of the Lawrence County Tourist Promotion Agency. And as Janet just mentioned, number one uh, website for listings of what to do in Lawrence County. You get the kids, you get your family members, all age groups, all kind of events going on. You'll find something to do right here, and you don't have to drive far. And you know what gas prices are like right now, right Janet? That's right. And Gary, I'd like to mention so many of them have no cost. We are so blessed in this area to have so many wonderful events, and a lot of times at no cost for the public. But some of them do, but so many don't. So I urge everyone to please check them out. There's so much you can do. I always like to say, if, if you're bored here, it's your own fault. 
because there's a lot to do. I agree totally with you. I want to ask you about the logo. I really like your logo. Thank you. It's the horse and buggy with fireworks behind it. Now, obviously, a horse and buggy connotates uh, Amish community, yes. right? Because Lawrence County is known for the Amish community up in the New Wilmington area. And then, of course, the fireworks because fireworks capital of America. That's right. And going back to the Amish portion of this, uh, we as residents take it for granted that we have this Amish community. Maybe we don't like driving behind them every day on rush hour, but at the same time, it's a huge draw in tourism. Believe it or not, the people that come in, we have the fifth largest old order Amish in the, the state of Pennsylvania. Many people that come in internationally, and they will come in through Boston, go down to Washington, over to Pittsburgh, they come here. They sign our guest book in our office. Then they take the drive yourself tour through the Amish countryside, go on up to Niagara, and then go back home. It's a nice long trip, but it's very much the international thing to do. Sometimes they do it in reverse, but they still do it. We're published highly as a good place to visit. We had a, tra a travel writer from England who came and we took her around the Amish countryside and she kept picking things up and looking under them like we all do with the Shenango China <laughs> in many years to see who made that pottery. They, I said, why are you doing that? And she, she said, I'm looking to see where it's made. I said, well, it's made here. Our Amish make it. She goes, well, I was just on the other side of the state and everything was made in China. Wow. So I feel fortunate that we have what we have here. I love their pies, too. Their pies are great. <laughs> now, donuts, we get calls for donuts, yeah. too. Now, the other part is a fireworks capital of America, and we like to blend those two together because it kind of says who we are as a community. Um, we are also looking for new brands with uh, New Visions, a group that I've been working with, and how we can better brand ourselves to the public, to the visitor, to the resident, and so you might see some new things coming out eventually. We have so much more to talk about with Janet Filatico from the Lawrence County Tourist Promotion Agency. So stay with us for segment three. That wraps up segment two, thanks to uh, our sponsors, Main Street Clothiers and Custom Tailors, Butts Flowers and Gifts, in New both in Newcastle, and Pizza Joe's. Everyone goes to Pizza Joe's with four locations in Newcastle. So keep it right here for Focus NC on NC TV 45. Gary's Wardrobe, furnished by Main Street Clothiers and Custom Tailors, 210 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Your favorite neighborhood pizza place. Everyone goes to Pizza Joe's. This program made possible by a grant from Pizza Joe's. Five would like to thank Butts, Flores, and Gifts for their fine cooperation for this podcast. Remember, when you need that special gift, it's Butts. Keep watching NCTV45.